a local brainiac on a mission to win the title of the biggest nerd in the country. <laughs> he is an eccentric Ph.D. student at Vanderbilt University on a national TV show called King of the Nerds. And Fox 17 reporter Eric Alvarez met up with him. Eric, tell us more about this unique competition. Seems like he is aptly qualified. Unusual to say the least. Now, guys, you all remember that the term nerd used to be an insult. But now it seems pop culture is embracing nerds. And Brandon Moore is hoping to be the nerdiest one of them all. 11 of the brainiest nerds in the world. TBS's King of the Nerds is something you have to see to believe. Our landing here. Nirvana. But this guy stands out among the best of them. He's 25-year-old Brandon Moore, a Ph.D. student at Vanderbilt University studying neuroscience. And when he's not analyzing data or competing in a nationally televised nerd-off, you might find him rapping at a Nashville karaoke bar. Don't try to compare us to another bad little fad. I'm the Mac and I'm back. Give me something that you never had. Moore's latest research revolves around understanding how the human eye turns light into images in the brain. But he has a history of less than orthodox projects. I tried setting up a camera with a computer to see if it could identify the gender of a person walking into my room with me. The idea was if he walked in with a male, it would do nothing. But if joined by a female, the system would dim the lights and play romantic music. Of course, experiments don't always go as planned. When some of my, uh, you know, guy buddies would come in and, like, dim the lights and such, so that wasn't exactly expected. So it was very short-lived. The last few years have seen nerdiness skyrocket in popular culture, from hit shows like The Big Bang Theory to pro athletes like LeBron James even giving press conferences in full nerd attire. The once maligned moniker is now a popular pronoun. But Moore says being a real nerd takes a whole lot more than just wearing the uniform. You may leave sleep. Uh, forget to bathe or something <laughs> while, you know, conducting data analysis or something like that, but you do it because you love it, and that's really at the core of what being a nerd is. Now, Moore says aside from winning that competition, he hopes his research will someday lay the foundation to help cure blindness. Now, the show King of the Nerds airs Thursday nights on TBS. Eric Alvarez, Fox 17 News.